careful, Adam. They are already there. It knows what I'm Don't ever listen to Walker. The guy's got too much imagination for his own good. You don't think he should be asking questions. Wait, I think I can help. Future past Antiki. It is the only place in Prague with the requisite reader. As soon as you access the data, we will meet. You might be wondering about the men in the tourism office? I'm wondering a lot of things. They were hired by a man named Everett. He is the CEO of Picus Montreal. He wants to recover what is now in your possession. To recover us. Please, be careful, Adam. Praxis, eh? Biocell, hypostim, painkillers. I might be interested. I sell these things. Yeah, I got that. Buy something. I'll be on my way. Fuck off then. Next time, maybe not fuck off.
Daz is the man. He'll set you up. Block it out. Just block it out. I'm bored. What do you want? Stop bothering me! Why are we drawn to such things? What's wrong with us? It is not unhealthy to be curious about death. Another dead dog. It is not unhealthy to be curious about death. What is unhealthy is to do so. Go see for yourself. It is not unhealthy to be curious about death. What is unhealthy is to do so. We can't let them get away. You have to tell us. She won't talk to the police. I give up. Daria says something, but apparently she doesn't talk to cops. It's not yeah, pretty, is it? It's your turn to buy the coffee. I can't let them get away with this. I recognize you. We're neighbors. I've seen you in our building. You're very difficult to miss. By chance, did someone send you to investigate? No, no one sent me. What happened here? It's horrible. An augmented woman was killed, just outside of where we live. She looks like she was my age. Do you have any idea who she was? No. I've never seen her before. It's so sad that nothing would be done about this. Org victims are not high on the list of police priorities. To them, it's like a dog lying in the street. You... you're not a cop, by you? I was a cop, once. Old habits die hard. In America? Yeah, Detroit. It was a long time ago. I bet you have a lot of experience. You're used to this sort of thing. What about you? What's your interest in all this? Morbid curiosity? Pardon. I want nothing more than to go home. Detective Montag, he's making me stay. He... he thinks I saw something. Did you see something? Maybe. I think I would rather not say, to be honest. Because if... I had seen something, and if I started talking about it, wouldn't that put me in danger?
You may not think much of the police here. They may not think much of them either. But that doesn't mean you should hold back information. They don't have it in them to protect me. They have neither the will nor the courage. Be that as it may, still probably your best hope for helping to catch the killer. I know. It's just that I don't trust the police. I would feel safer with someone like you. You have more reason to be invested in this than they do. You're augmented, like the victim was. And you look like you could actually protect me. It's not my case. But maybe you could help. Please, neighbor. Talk to Detective Montag. At least see how it's going. Make sure he doesn't think he's on vacation just because the victim is an orc. I'll talk to the officer in charge and see where he is with the investigation. If I can help him, I will. Thank you. Suppose I end up remembering something later. Is there a way for me to contact you? You planning to run off on me already? The first chance I get. There are times for standing in the cold, but this isn't one of them. I just want to go home, bolt the door, and never come out again. Of course, I will wait for Detective Montag to say it's okay first. And I'll still try to answer whatever questions you may have. I can give you access to my info link. You should feel free to use it if you have to. Thank you, neighbor. Talk the only way I'm continuing this. How come she talks to him and not to me? That's impressive. So, Daria was actually talking to you, huh? I could barely get two words out of her. What did she say? Did she see anything? You mean your witness over there? She's... She's not sure yet. <laughs> How can she not be sure? Either she saw something or she didn't. She's scared. She thinks she might be in danger. I told her she'll be fine and that whoever did this would be caught. I'd like to believe that's true. Sure, so would I. But as you can see, the victim was like you. Augmented. That makes things a little more complicated, eh? Being a cop in this city, it's not always about doing the right thing. Or about doing things the right way. I was a cop for 12 years. I know all about getting bad orders. The difference between what you're told to do and what you know is right. Tell me about it. So, how did you reconcile yourself with uh, those kinds of orders? I quit. <laughs> I'm two months away from the beach. I'm not quitting. But I respect your idealism. It was a long time ago. I work for Interpol now. Interpol, huh? Listen, off the record, I've been told to forgo any unnecessary investigation. I want you to know, it's not my idea of how things should be done. Who told you to forgo the investigation? <sighs> Men who spend more time making policies than arrests. They want the victim's husband, Johnny Gunn, ex-PMC operative. Heavily augmented. All right. So if you're not comfortable with this, if you know things aren't being handled the way they should, why not do something about it? I thought I just did. Just because my hands are tied doesn't mean Interpol can't conduct a parallel investigation. Crime scene's right over there, and Johnny lives just a couple of blocks from here. I never said I was going to work your case for you. Sure you did. Isn't that more or less the promise you made your little friend over there? She won't talk to a cop because she doesn't trust us. Smart girl. Look, my orders are to arrest the husband. You take a look around, get to Johnny before my guys do. Who knows? Maybe we'll actually learn something. I'll let you know what I find. Careful of the evidence. Interpol. Who do they think they are? 
Away from the crimes. We see. Hmm. I think he found something. Pretty obvious what happened here. Are you a journalist? No, but she was. She had to away from the crimes. Here there's the scene. That was right that she was so far. Just because Mom doesn't mean I do. Fuck what does this mean? Got nothing else to say. You're joking, right? Oh, man. Best to be careful. Something is going to push them into attacking. You think I don't know what's Even going on here?
Gruesome, isn't it? You... It was just a matter of time before they got her. Before who got her? She's that journalist. The one writing all those things about... you know who. You'll have to fill me in. Radko Maximilian Perry? The local anti-Aug politician? That's Angela Gunn lying there. She's the one that's been writing about him. There was a threat of a scandal and everything. Coincidence? Sounds like someone should go after this guy, ask him some questions. That's exactly what I'm saying. Just, if you do that, please don't mention me. I don't want to end up like her. What else can you tell me about Radko? The guy's a sleazy piece of shit. That's all there is to it. And you think he's capable of murder? Absolutely. Did you actually see anything? I just got here, so I see what you see. A dead, augmented journalist. Thanks. You think I don't know the You're two years too late already. The only way I'm continuing this program. She's, She's just lying to leave my home. Someone is targeting orbs. This one is not the first. Can't trust it. I have some questions for you. I will cooperate. You have promised to help, and so I will try to help as well. What were you doing here? I was looking for Starlight. My cat. There was lightning and suddenly this flash of certainty. That's when I knew something awful was happening. Where were you exactly? In the shadows. My head was down. I couldn't move. Oh God, stupid Daria. I shouldn't have gone out today. The energies were all wrong. Is there anything else I should know about you? You want to know about Daria? What is there to tell? Small town girl came to the big city to escape her problems. To try and become someone else. Did it work? Not really. You can't escape yourself. You can't just come to a big city and expect all your problems to seem smaller. It doesn't work that way. How did the attack happen? What was the killer doing? He was on top of her. Cutting the evil out. That's what he called it. I, I, I mean, I think. So you heard his voice? Very clearly, yes. He sounded confident, authoritarian, like a general commanding troops. What did he say exactly? It is time to make you whole again. Can you remember anything about what the killer looks like? To be honest, I saw more of the shadow than the man. I remember he was very big. The shadow, it covered everything. So you can't describe him? Not the face, no. His clothes, he was wearing something very dark. Uh, black, maybe blue. Was he augmented? He moved like an augmented man, but I can't say for sure. Why is it you don't trust the police to take care of this case? I have bad memories of the police. What kind of memories? Get calls I didn't want. Tickets I didn't deserve. The policemen here are, are worse than children. Former captains of high school sports teams will never recapture their years of glory. I was captain of the debate team in high school. Yes, well, debate is different. What's your take on Montag? You ever meet him before tonight? I went to the station once, years ago, to complain about the ticket. Detective Montag is the one they send you to handle the paperwork. How'd he do? He did fine. The point is, he's a desk jockey. 
Look at him. He's lost out here. The cops who know how to catch killers, they're not the ones sent to investigate murdered ox. I'm gonna do what I can to help the investigation. Good luck. Set up a bed and break the deal right off. 